Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to give one last effort to get this PTO shaft unseized. I've been fighting with it on and off for the last couple weeks. This is supposed to telescope in and out to hook it up from the finish mower to the tractor. And when I tried to hook it up, it would not move at all. I've tried to use a three jaw puller. I've been soaking it in penetrating oil. I've tied a chain around it and put it around a tree and tugged on it and it just will not move. So I've got a chain hooked up to it today. I'm gonna hook it up to the front loader and I'm gonna heat it up and use an air chisel to see if I can tap it out. So let's see what happens. I'm thinking that if I heat this outer sleeve, hopefully the metal will expand and maybe break the rust free. But this plastic guard is on the way. I'm trying not to melt it either. It smells wonderful. At this point, if I damage the metal, I don't care because I was this close to buying a new PTO shaft. I can always clean it up with the grinder or a file. Yeah, it's boogering it up pretty good. I've also tried marble mystery oil, PB blaster, been soaking for about two weeks it's just seized I'm not sure why I used it not too long ago too and it seemed fine and it was greased before the season so I'm not sure what happened but I think me hitting with the hammer starting to peen the metal over I might actually be making it worse might be a lost cause I really don't have access to any more of the outer part up here because of this protector and I can't take this off while this is connected. Yeah, I had this tied around the back of the tractor and this end down here around a tree with this chain and tugging on it and it still would not go i was hoping heat would help but yeah it must be rust welded or something i, I don't know <sighs> running out of options here it's palm nailer here Hoping maybe the vibrations of this will help. Probably not. Teeth are getting loose. Problem with heating it is there's so much metal, it just acts as a heat sink. Hopefully, I won't 
salt splatter hot grease in my face. pool on the u-joint but at this point I don't care I'm gonna make sure I'm not underneath the loader I think it moved. I think it moved. Holy crap. Oh, I got it. Holy crap. Yes, it worked. Finally. Oh my gosh, guys. I've been fighting this for weeks. Yeah. Oh, it's still hot. Okay. That was stupid. I mean, it's got grease on it. What happened? And it doesn't look rusted. I don't know. I don't care at this point. Sweet. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today. I think the trick was this palm nailer. All of the rapid vibrations just kind of broke it free. Uh, that, with some heat, did the trick. This is nothing special. It's just a Banks palm nailer. Uh, it's meant to drive nails with your palm, uh, but it vibrates really fast. Um, so, as you can see, it worked. So, guys, if you ever have a stuck PTO shaft and you've tried everything that you can think of, uh, you might want to give one of these palm nailers a try. Hope it works for you because it worked for me. Thanks. Have a great day.